Hello guys, welcome to techev.com, your solution providers. My name is Jack and in this video I'm going to show you how you can animate a person on Photoshop and make it look like a cartoon. Okay, to start with, uh, we need to create a new layer over here and uh, zoom in. Okay, we're going to use the pen tool. Make sure you have the option path here and not, not shape and uh, we're going to select the skin okay to save some time I'm going to fast forward the video and get back to you once I'm done okay so I'm done with the face and the neck and now we will right click and uh, choose fill path go to color and by using the eye drop tool uh, it will pick the color that is uh, mostly used in the face maybe a pale skin color would be the uh, best choice and then click OK now if I turn off this layer you see that nothing has happened but over here we have the shape of the head and the neck so by following the same process we will create a new layer and turn off the layer 1 uh, and we will now uh, select the hair again by using the pen tool uh, it doesn't have to be a perfect selection you know, just um, an average selection would be good again applying the same process we create a new layer and now we're going to select the eyebrows and uh, again guys it doesn't have to be perfect remember it is just an, uh, a drawing animation uh, besides everything that um, okay so I'll right click fill path and using the eye Dropper tool, uh, we select the color of the eyebrows. If you like a different color, for example, a more um, a more a light color, feel free to experiment with your taste. Uh, I will play safe here and go with a bit of a brown eyebrows so there we go again that's what we've got so far uh, and I'll keep doing this for the rest of the body parts um, to then show you the final trick to create our animation So what we need now is to create a background which would be uh, a color of our own choosing. I think this would be a nice color. Uh, the background has to be above uh, the background layer 
and beyond every other layer otherwise it wouldn't work I mean look at that if the background layer is above any other layer then uh, we wouldn't have the animation result okay now by playing with the layers over here you know putting a layer up and down we can use the brush tool and uh, the eyedropper tool and make sure that uh, there are no gaps over here for instance um, without those gaps or those gaps between the ear and now you can play with uh, the brackets you know to get the brush tool bigger or smaller and uh, that's mostly what this technique uses uh, it is not hard at all it is actually very easy but it just takes uh, too much time you know you have to use too many layers uh, and make sure that the layers don't get bumped together or you want you or you won't have the result you want um, but other than that you should be just okay now we need to make sure that the layers are correctly uh, put because you wouldn't want the skin color uh, drawn on this shirt and that's about it and now we have an animated version of uh, this guy here with the background of course so that's it guys thank you for watching uh, if you have any questions uh, leave a comment and I will do my best to reply for more tips and tricks visit techiv.com and until the next video take care